For more on our top five videos, you can always head to the video section of our website, theweathernetwork.com. It's Friday the 13th. I'm Emily Vukovic. Thanks for joining us. We've been talking about the heat and the humidity and the weekend. It looks great. I'm going to have a peek at your weekend forecast in just a moment. But first, we're going to check in with Kasia Badurka. She joins us live this morning in Port Dover. I'm feeling very cool here on this bike, but the forecast is very warm. In fact, some would say it's going to be a hot day in southern Ontario. We come to you from Port Dover, the world's largest one-day bike rally happening today, of course, it being Friday the 13th. Now, when it's nice like today, they expect close to 100,000 people in this town that usually has about 6,000 people. So it's going to be huge today. It's going to be loud and a lot of fun. Thanks, Kasia. So much fun to be there. Southern Ontario, Kasia Baderka joins us live in Port Dover. It's Friday the 13th and we have a full moon and it's particularly creepy today because it's June and the June full moon is large and creepy, but that's not the big story today. Of course, every Friday the 13th, the world's largest one day bike rally happens here in Port Dover. They're expecting close to 100,000 people here because of the great weather. Anytime the weather is beautiful like it is today, uh, a lot of people come out. So far, it's relatively quiet. Of course, it's still morning, but this place will be rammed and jam packed. Bikes, bikers, and all the big fans of the culture. Okay, I'm going to send it back to you inside with more on your weather. Thanks, Cash. You fit in perfectly there. You really do. You need a motorcycle, I think. Okay, we are going to be seeing high pressure moving in through southern Ontario. That is, and she's in Port Dover. Let's see, we have a full moon and it's Friday the 13th. Now, that doesn't happen very often, but what does? Every Friday the 13th, there's a massive bike rally that happens here in Port Dover. And when the weather is nice, like it is going to be today, like it is today, I should say, uh, we can expect a good 100,000 people here to enjoy the sights, the sounds, the bikes, and the bike culture. Could be a little hot, though, for leather, for wearing leather, because temperatures are going to be feeling into the mid-20s. Thank you so much, Cash. We're on the back side of our cold front now, so lingering showers, not so much from this point forward into the day, though. Let's go, though, because today's Friday, of course, the 13th. Let's go to Cash first in Port Dover. I am having the time of my life. Who says that Friday the 13th is unlucky? Port Dover, Friday the 13th. This happens every Friday the 13th. I just love riding. You can feel the wind in your hair, the weather up against your skin, and great weather here for today. There will be a lot of people at today's rally. Back to you inside. Woohoo! <laughs> That's awesome. She looks like she completely fits in, and she does. So let's take a look at our short term forecast. On the morning show, if you missed it, body shops and repair crews are going to be busy in parts of Texas. Take a look at this tail. That's right, golf ball-sized tail moved in through the region with intense thunderstorms. And Kasia Badurka on Friday joined us in the lovely Port Dover. I am having a blast here at the world's largest one-day bike rally. Amazing weather for this, and because of that, we're going to have a huge turnout for today. Join us again Monday morning. Kevin and I will talk about the rising heat and humidity, and Tom Reynolds will get you where you need to go, school or work, with his traffic report. I am having the time of my life. Who says that Friday the 13th is unlucky? Port Dover, Friday the 13th. This happens every Friday the 13th. I just love riding. You can feel the wind in your hair, the weather up against your skin, and great weather here for today. There will be a lot of people at today's rally. Back to you inside. Woohoo! <laughs> That's awesome.